we are going to put Oreo in his new backpack just to test it. We're not going to go for a ride today. At least not right now. We might go tonight. Thanks for watching my videos. If you want to see more videos like you're seeing on the screen right now, go ahead and go down to the bottom and hit that subscribe button. If you click the bell next to it, you'll be notified when I upload. I'd surely appreciate it if you do that. And if you want to join the conversation down in the comment section below, go ahead and head down there and tell me what you think about my video. If you head down to my description and hit the show more button, make sure you check out my Instagram. I'm going to be uploading a whole bunch of stuff there as well. This is called a K9 sport sack. They got a bunch of different colors, different sizes. Um, they make boosters, which I actually have one. So the bag actually has another bag, which is right here that attaches to the back with these little clips. And I have all of his treats in here, water, bowls, food bowls, food. And then they have these patch places here uh, which I have ordered one, it's just not here yet. It'll say Oreo on it, and it's customized. And uh, the one I got is black with white lettering, so you can see it kind of like this. This is the bag that holds all the stuff in it. And it literally attaches to the back of him. So when he's in this bag, you just put this over him. And I don't know how this works in the summer, because it does feel like he gets hot with this on. The material on the bag itself is pretty thick. So I may not use this whenever we are going for long trips in the heat. But hopefully the venting and everything works good. It does have a couple little elastic places here for water bottles and things like that. I'm going to demonstrate how this works. Basically all you do is lift them up. Thanks for being a good puppy dog. And set them down. And he's pretty good at this now. We've done it like three or four times. He's re really patient and he loves it so he knows that if he goes in this, he's probably gonna go for a ride. So you just set him inside the bag here, kind of unfold it, have him sit down. There you go, good boy. He's already got one foot in. You just lift this up. Um, if he has a collar on, you can clip this. It's not necessarily needed, but for extra safety, you just clip this here. That'll hold him in place if anything were to ever happen, but it's pretty secure as it is, so you won't really have to worry about it. There you go. And then this flap needs to go underneath this zipper so that you don't catch the dog's hair or skin on the zipper when you zip it up. Just pull it over like this and you just zip this up. Now this loop is a safety loop, and what you do is you just stick it through the uh, clip here clip this together and then all of the straps have buckles here that you can you can slide down and then there's two buckles here again you have this they're already tight for him and then that and then all you gotta do is lift his little face up and you can grab it by this if you need to but you want to hold really you know keep him very firm and then hold on to him with him being this light it's easy for me to just pick him up but you can also do this on a chair and it might be easier on you if your dog's big but he's such a small dog it's really easy and then all you do is grab this hold him as you're putting your arm through here and then give me your paw stick your paw out there yeah and then you just grab this other one and you just kind of swing him around gently I'm sure you guys can't see this and then he's on and then you got these two straps here you pull down to tighten it up and then you got your mid strap uh, that goes over your your chest chest strap I guess that's what it's called and the chest strap is here let me just show you chest strap is adjustable so you can move it up or down so it's comfortable for you and then he's just dangling on the back and he loves it don't you love it you love it don't you if you take him out uh what you'll do is you'll loosen these straps again to get it loose on your arm so it's easier to get it off unbuckle the mid uh chest strap take one arm off while you're holding on to 
to this like so so hang on to this while you add the other one off and then you just grab this hold on to him grab that loop over here and just gotta be very careful with him right so then when you want to take him out I usually just put him over here set him down unbuckle him and then unzip him there's that pull him out a little bit oh yeah I forgot to attach the, the collar you gotta undo the, the collar here the carabiner from his leash pull him out oh <laughs> you weren't supposed to fall puppy dog so the bag is pretty comfortable except for when you have it cinched down uh, this part right here goes up under your underarm and it does kind of hurt after a while so I may try to put some padding here and once you get them in the pack and you got them all ready to go you got them buckled in you have another clip here and another clip here and then two on the other side and this just basically sets back here on him Clip this in and clip that in and you can tighten it uh, other side same thing clip it in and then when he's on your back you basically he's wearing a backpack too so you're wearing him he's wearing this I do have the patch coming here soon so you guys will see that in an upcoming video but this and is now the for some raw and uncut footage of Oreo in the K9 sport sack Drive by the lake again?